This is tutorial number 85, and it covers the measure item feature within Katia v5. To start off, open up the fishing reel step file, which is included on the DVD. Now, with the measure tools, the measure item is the next tool that we're going to be using, and what it does is it measures a single item at a time. So compared to the measure between, we would need to select uh, multiple items to measure between the two of them. The measure item is only going to measure that single part. So let's click it. And again, you have a selection mode just like the other one. So right now it's at any geometry, and you're able to choose a point, edge, and whatnot, uh, just if you need to uh, filter your selections. So let's leave it at any geometry. And if you look at customize, there's a bunch of different uh, options that you get here. Because you're also able to choose like a part and faces uh, by itself, you're going to be able to uh, take the surface and the volume, and you're also able to get uh, dimensions for those two. So when you select an object, it's going to take whatever is uh, viable for it. So if you choose a line, it's not going to tell you the area, because there's not going to be any area to the line. It'll just like tell you the length. So you're able to change any of these if you want to. For now, just leave it alone. Click OK. And let's choose a straight edge. So up at the top here, let's choose a straight edge here. And we get a value of 12.659. Now if we choose the radius here, the curve, we're going to get an, a radius with the R there of 4.75. And it's also going to tell you where the center point is in respect to the uh, assembly. So you can tell that these numbers here, how it's e to the negative 0, 0, 6, means that the y and z are at 0. And all this is is really 129 millimeters straight up. So if we also just choose, say, a point, it's going to tell us its position within the assembly. So let's find a point. Let's choose this point right here. And you're going to get a positioning just like that. So it's going to tell you that this point is located in the x, y, and z at this location. Now, if you're using uh, positioning with your assembly, this is very useful. So you can tell exactly where your part is or certain points or whatnot in your assembly. Now, if you choose, say, a surface, it's going to tell you, say, how much the area is. Now, if you choose an entire part, it's going to tell you the volume, and you'll find the volume down there. And if you choose the entire fishing reel, it's going to tell you the entire fishing reel volume. So this tool, it allows you to select any of those edges, lines, points, surfaces, or parts and assemblies, and it's going to give you information strictly on that item. And this concludes our tutorial on the measure item feature within Katia V5.